Hello dear friends, this is Grandmaster Halkias Delius. I'm a Greek Grandmaster, I'm a Grandmaster for 20 years and uh, we're gonna have today uh, together a tactical session, some videos on tactics, on recognizing ideas, patterns and mo uh, motives, classical motives and uh, I am pretty sure you will find all this very helpful and I want you to join me and uh, take a good look on how we can improve on your tactics. Before this, I would like to introduce myself and tell you a few things about me. I was born in Thessaloniki in Greece and I started playing chess uh, at the age of nine, nine and a half, which I consider is a very late age for someone who wants to uh, do something special in chess. I consider the age of five or six ideal for a kid to start. And I started very late, but I managed with hard work to get uh, the lost time back and I'm pretty happy about this. Uh, my passion for chess uh, and uh, for personal study and uh, working uh, alone many hours showed and um, I managed to bring some successes quite early. So I won the Greek Championship under 12 and twice the Greek Championship under 16 and this led to further successes like uh, European and World Championship medals in the youth ages, three European medals and one World Championship medal. And I'm very, very happy about all this. Uh, it brought, uh, you know, some uh, uh, results in my chess career. And it helped me also taking a very difficult decision of turning into a chess pro. Uh, all this career, let's say, I would like to uh, say that it had uh, four basic parts uh, that I would like to share with you how it went. Uh, so first it was the youth championships, Greek, European, world championships, whatever. And uh, this um, I managed to show my talent in these uh, tournaments, but also, you know, like to get uh, like a real tough player, battle-hardened uh, player and uh, turning me to a semi-pro. And all these things uh, took me to the second part, which uh, you decide to become a professional. And at the age of 18, I started playing much more tournaments abroad. I played some tournaments, some international tournaments in Greece and also in some other places already. But on 18, I turned uh, more serious into pro. There were many uh, stories that I can share with you about all this uh, playing as a chess professional around. I would like to mention a very, very important name who helped me and we, we shared lots of stories. The Greek uh, grandmaster, very famous Vasilios Kotronias, who was like a great friend, uh, analyst, uh, second uh, coach and uh, co-worker and my mentor all these years from uh, my 20s to my 30s. We worked a lot together. Uh, we shared uh, room and also many experiences in many, many tournaments. From the period of 1820 to 30, I turned into a real pro, trying to, you know, like to make a living out of chess. Collaboration with Vasilios was very, very important. Also entering the Greek national team was very, very important in traveling with the team, playing some very tough tournaments, meeting all the great players around the world. That was a great experience. Then we go to the third part, which is like... Uh, I would consider the peak of my career around 30s I get to 2600 which is a very important landmark for me and also I managed to qualify for the World Cup which is a dream for many many chess players. I still have done this only once. I hope in the future maybe again but it was like a very special period for me making all my dreams come true. So I went to the World Cup played against a great opponent, Alexander Morozovic, and managed to draw this match 1-1, but lost it in tie breaks. It was a little bit tough after, because uh, although I did well, my dreams were a little bit uh, broken. And uh, from then on, although I turned into coaching and uh, having some ideas of how uh, to coach uh, players and uh, also teach and make uh, videos, lectures, everything. I also managed to keep on playing and with uh, success, I could say, which turned into winning some international tournaments still and also making some very, very special showings with the national team that I'm very proud of. In 2000, 
2016 in the Olympiad in Baku, a really great performance. And also in 2019, a great performance in the European Championship in Batumi, which resulted in having a gold medal in my board. And that's a thing that I'm really proud of. I can tell you, I'm very, very happy for my medals as a, uh, in my youth, and they're very important for me. But this last one that I managed when my chess career was, let's say, uh, when I was already old, it uh, gave me particular pleasure. Uh, that's a few words for me. Uh, I hope uh, you'll be here and uh, we're going to learn some tactics together. Please uh, watch and enjoy. Thank you very much. Thanks for your time and I hope you enjoyed the video. Here it's time for action. This is the initial page of my website and here you can click give me access to get access to free lessons. You can read this page and if you scroll down here you can add your name and your email. After that you're going to take a free lesson how to avoid chess blunders. So time for action is now and you're very welcome to join my mail list.